Hey sis, good morning. How you doing? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Viv. And if this is your first time watching me, sis, welcome. And if you are not a stranger to the channel, sis, welcome back. Yesterday's situation at Coach Outlet made today absolutely necessary. And I'm so glad I waited to do this unboxing with you guys because yesterday was a mess, wasn't it? Girl. Anyway, last time I did a video like this, I asked you what kind of coffee you like to drink. I'm sharing one of my favorite coffees and this is a German brand. And sis, this coffee is amazing. It is so flavorful. And so screenshot it. It is so flavorful. And I just add a little bit of caramel macchiato creamer in mine. And that's it. Oh, and sis, get you one of these. Get a Yeti. Oh, my goodness. Anyway, I wanted to go ahead and do this video early because I'm, I plan on being in the garden today. We're going to get rain for the next few days. And I need to go ahead and get some seeds in the ground Sis, let's get into it so i'm gonna talk and cut open the box okay so I, a few weeks ago a few weeks ago when i had um picked up my studio bag i was at the boutique at the coach boutique and i was talking to let me turn this around because i don't know the information i might have okay all right i was talking to my essay about a piece from a previous collection that i that i missed out on she said she might be able to order something from the collection but she didn't know what it was um but guys you already know how I love belt bags. I adore belt bags. So that's what this is. Now, I also said a few weeks ago that I really wanted to get into the habit of... Yeah, we're going to unbox. I wanted to get into the habit of curating pieces that were like works of art. You know, because I already have all the, all the black bags, I think... I'm going to buy for now, even though I secretly want one more. But I want to curate a better collection. When she started going through her system, guess what? This bag was sold out. And I was like, oh my gosh. So, a few days later, I was on coach at night, <laughs> stalking the site as usual. And I came across this bag. And I hit add to cart so fast. Now, mind you, I saw hers in store and I was like, oh my goodness, I would love that in my collection. And when she tried to um, look for it, she couldn't order it. So I found it. Oh gosh. And I ordered it for myself. Now, okay. Mm. Let's see. I see a little spot here. So I'm going to go ahead and clean that out this is from the mint and surf collection oh oh they stuffed this one okay let's see i'm gonna go ahead and put this here it's from the mint and surf oh wow they even have the security tag i wonder if this was a return Hmm. Checking it. Okay. When she had hers on in store, I actually tried it on. I don't own any coach bags with silver hardware. This bag right here reminds me of Brooklyn, the graffiti. It is a statement to me. Let me see. Am I less wowed? No. I'm just trying to really check and make sure it's not wonky. It looks a little wonky there. Hmm. Let's see. Of course, you know, I don't baby bags. Okay. Mint and surf. It says mint and surf right here. 
on the hang tag you guys own a piece from this collection i'm gonna have to go ahead and stuff it really well first things first i'm gonna go ahead and condition this bag i'm gonna condition it because it feels kind of like i don't know it has like a coating on it but i'm really not liking that little spot right there so i'm gonna go ahead and condition this bag right away i love it though because when she had it on in store she had it like across her chest and it looked comfortable i'm gonna see yes i like that yep it still feels nice and comfortable oh look at that one hand i love convenience you know, I gotta check out the zipper girl. Okay. Well, this is one more piece added to my collection. The only thing that I'm not a fan of is this little spot, but I am gonna clean her up and condition her before I put her on the shelf. I don't wanna keep collecting the same kind of bag. I need a few statement pieces. So this will be the second, and I like it. I definitely have to compare what can fit in here. Maybe, maybe they're all the same, but as far as size goes, just making sure, and I'm smelling it. I'm making sure that I am the first one. But you know what? I think this was a return. Do you know why? Because if this wasn't a return, it would have been wrapped. Because mm? Coach, Coach wraps their bags very very well so this was a possible return hmm but i remember that it's a sold out collection so i will see how this looks after i clean it up i mean i'm not mad at it you know i buy pre-loved bags hmm so the price point for this one was like right at 200 you know, which is a significant drop from how much it was when it came out. So, yep, we're adding this bum bag to my collection. I'm going to clean her up. Let's see how nice she looks because to me, she definitely feels a little like. Drunk. I don't know. She just she just don't feel, you know, but hey, I wanted this piece of my collection and now I have it. Oh, gosh, I think this no buy is going to be a really good thing. It is. Sis, I'm going to get, I'm going to drink the rest of my coffee. I am going to get in the garden. I am going to be sharing some projects, some interior design and decor and a few DIY projects in my shorts, in the community post. And hopefully um, you guys enjoy that type of content and we could maybe start a slow buy, no buy together. I don't know, girl. Let's see. Let's see. Well, tell me what you think about this bag. Uh, I wish it was wrapped up, wrapped up. But I could tell it was probably a return. I'm not mad, though, because I wanted it. And it does remind me of New York City. Girl, this is about to look so good with denim. Oh, my goodness. This is a whole vibe right here. I like it. It's kind of rock and roll, edgy, graffiti, hip-hop, all that in a bag. I think it's cute. Sis... Thank you for watching my video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.